Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. Y'all already know what time it is. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how much I made in dividends in the month of April. Now, dividends is by far the most passive income way to, to make passive income. You literally do nothing and get paid out every single month, guys, through dividend investing inside of the stock market. I'm gonna tell you guys what companies paid me out this month. Some of these companies are real estate REITs, dividend aristocrats, and dividend kings. Now, a real estate REIT are companies that have to deal with real estate type properties, right? They usually pay out higher dividends because by law, they are required to pay out 90% of their taxable income through dividends back to their investors, guys. And dividends is what companies pays out to their investors either monthly, quarterly, semi-annually, or annually to attract retail investors like us to invest into their company. They're saying, hey, if you invest into our company, we'll pay you out a check every single month just from investing into our company. That's pretty much what dividends is, is passive income. The other companies that pay me out are dividend aristocrats. Dividend aristocrats are companies that are inside the S&P 500. That means these are the top 500 companies in America. So you have to be inside the S&P 500 and have increased your dividend yield every single year for the last 25 years. So first of all, it's hard to get inside the S&P 500. And then you have to increase your dividends every single year for the last 25 years in order to become a dividend aristocrat. And those companies have paid me out in the month of April. Also, I have a dividend king. Dividend kings are companies that have been inside the S&P 500 and increased their dividends for the last 50 years. So long before I was born, these companies have been paying out dividends to their investors every single month. So I'm gonna let you guys know what companies I'm investing in to pretty much, I'm very, very close to reaching my dividend investing goal. The goal that I started at the beginning of my investing career, my goal was to reach $100 in dividends every single month. And I'm so, so close to reaching that $100 goal. So I'm gonna let you guys know how exactly how close I am and what companies pay me out, which ones are real estate REITs, which one are dividend kings, and which one are dividend aristocrats in this video. But before we dive into it, this video is brought to you by Weeble. Sign up now by clicking the link down in the description, deposit $100, and now you can receive two free stocks valued up to $1,850 each. With those two free stocks, you can keep them inside the platform and decide to use it, or you can sell those two free stocks and withdraw all of your money. It's literally free money. Also, I left a link down to Coinbase down in the description. That is by far the easiest way to buy and sell cryptocurrency. But enough talking, let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. Welcome back dreamers. Here we are on my Robinhood account. Yes, this is the first time I've done one of these videos that my account has finally reached above $50,000 and I blew it right out of the water. I am at $55,971.06 and I had an incredible month of in April. I'm up 9.68% up $4,939. So April has been an amazing month no april fools for me baby just skyrocketed all the way up to the top 9.68 percent and that's through the help of a lot of my growth stocks i don't just invest into dividend paying stocks i invest into good quality stocks that just so happen to pay dividends i don't chase dividends i let dividends come to me so let's go ahead and get into these <laughs> these 10 dividend paying stocks that paid me out in the month of april Okay, here we are on the very first one, Coca-Cola, ticker symbol KO. This is the dividend king that I was telling you guys about. Coca-Cola is inside of the S&P 500 and have increased their dividends for the last 50 years, guys. I have a total of four shares, paying out 42 cents per share. So I collected $1.68. If we take a look at Coke over the last year, they're up 16.65%. And I am up on Coke. Um, one percent so i was in the hole for a little bit but now i'm up if we look at coke dividend yield they pay out 3.03 percent they have a 
0.03% dividend yield. And they have a very large, well, you guys know what Coca-Cola is. I don't have to talk about their market cap. It's a billion dollar company, right? But uh, Coca-Cola, they pay out their dividends quarterly. That means they pay out their dividends every three months, four times a year. So um, that is Coca-Cola. That's gonna bring my total to $1.68. The next one that paid me out is Walmart. Walmart also is a quarterly paying dividend stock. I own 6.6 .6 shares, paying out 55 cents per share for a total of $3.67. If we take a look at Walmart, of course it's Walmart. So over the last year, they're up 6%, and I am currently up 11% on Walmart. My market value is $920.22. And you guys know that they're a billion dollar company, but they have a dividend yield of 1.55%. So it's not as high as Coke, but Walmart is the best superstores one of the best superstores out there in the world so that's walmart so with walmart paying me out three dollars and 67 cents that's going to bring my total to five dollars and 35 cents the next one is agnc them now agnc is one of the real estate stocks that i was telling you guys about and i told you guys that real estate stocks which is reits they usually have a higher dividend yield so I have 102 shares of AGNC, paying out 12 cents per share. So they pay me out a total of $12.24. If we take a look at AGNC over the last year, they're up 44.9%. So they had an amazing year and I'm up 24% on AGNC with a market value of $1,800. And like I said before, um, REITs have higher dividend yields than the growth companies. So they have a dividend yield of 8.24%, guys. Usually stocks only go up 6% in a year. Their dividends alone is 8.24%. So if AGNC never cut their dividends and you want some guaranteed um, returns, 8.24% is looking like a pretty sweet return in just one year. So with AGNC paying me out $12.24, that's gonna bring my total to $17.59. The next one is IIPR. Not gonna talk about this one. Real estate stock, if you wanna look it up, Look it up. I can't talk about it on YouTube. I own 1.5 shares, paying me out $1.32 per share for a total of $2 this time. Um, over the last year, they're up 139%. I'm up 90%. Um, they have a dividend yield of 2.63%. So yeah, not gonna talk about this one. Not gonna get the mod times on this channel. But with IIPR paying me out $2.06, that's gonna bring my total to $19.65. The next one is also a real estate stock, a real estate REIT, um, ticker symbol O, Realty Income. This one is known as the monthly paying dividend stock. I own eight shares, paying out 23 cents per share for a total of $1.89. This is a Realty Income. So they're a real estate REIT. They're up 37% in the last year. I'm up 9% and they have a dividend yield of 4.04% and they pay out that every single month that is why this one is known as the monthly paying dividend stock the contracts that they have with, under ticker symbol o uh with their uh, rental properties the that the lands that they lease to these companies um they're they're gonna get their returns back and that is why they're known as the monthly paying dividend stock so with ticker symbol o paying me out a dollar and 89 cents that's gonna bring my total to 21 dollars and 54 cents the next one's psec prospect capital have 11 shares, six cents per share, paying me out 66 cents. Over the last year, they're killing it, up 92%. And I'm up 719%. I own 11 shares, I'm up $89. Average cost was a dollar in. And they have an 8.9 dividend percent yield. So yes, this is also a real estate stock. And this one pays out monthly as well. So hey, these high dividend REITs are the ones that usually pays out every single month. So with Prospect Capital paying me out 66 cents, that's gonna bring my total to $22.20. The next one is GAP, ticker symbol GPS. I own 14 shares, 24 cents per share, um, paying me out $3.49. Take a look at GAP, they have killed it up 379% in a single year. I think that's because Kanye West got a clothing line coming out with them pretty soon. Uh, I am up 141% um, on GPS on GAP uh, with a market value of $479. Oh man, I really wish I would have bought so much more GAP back in the day because when I heard the Kanye West news that he was making a clothing line with them, I should have 
at least bought 100 shares. But Gap right now is paying out a dividend to me with um, for $3.49. So with Gap paying me out $3.49, that's going to bring my total to $25.69. The next one is SPHD, PowerShare S&P 500 High Dividend Low Volatile ETF. This is a ETF. That means ETFs are companies that invest into a broad range of different companies and have them inside their portfolio. So if you want to invest into all the technology companies, there are ETFs out there for that. If you want to invest into all of the um, energy sector companies, there's ETFs out there for that. But this ETF focuses on high dividend, low volatile uh, stocks, right? So I have 30 shares paying me out 12 cents per share for a total of $3.79. Uh, over the last year, they're up 38 cents. I'm up 8% on SPHD and they have a 4.74 dividend yield. And this is also a monthly paying dividend stock. So with SPHD paying me out $3.79, that's going to be my total to $29.48. The next one is PEY. This is also a another ETF. This one pays out quarterly. I have 100 shares, uh, six cents per share, paying me out $6.64. If we take a look at PEY, they're up 49% over the last year. I'm up 27% on PEY, on PEY with a market value of $2,052. Uh, we take a look at the dividend yield. They have a 4.6 dividend yield so with pey paying me out six dollars and 64 cents that's going to bring my total to 36 dollars and 12 cents and to the last stock that paid me out stock number 10 this is nrz this is also a real estate stock this one pays out quarterly um ticker symbol nrz new residential investments i have 190 shares paying out 20 cents per share and this one has paid me out the most by far $38. If we take a look at NRZ over the last year, they're up 97%. But if we look at the last couple of years, I bought in at NRZ around $17 and then bought the dip all the way down to $5. That would have been an amazing time to get in. So I am down just a little bit, 12% on NRZ, but, but I have made that back from dividends alone, guys. If we take a look at um, NRZ dividends, right now they're paying out 4.79%. They used to have a 14% dividend yield, but they cut them. That's why the price had dropped. Of course, we all know why they cut them, right? So um, the dividend yield had dropped and they're slowly starting to recover. So, so me buying the dip when it was all the way down to $5 helped lower my um, average cost to $11 so um, hopefully in the next month or so it's, it's looking like it's back on the right track hopefully in the next month the next time I get paid out in dividends I will be back in a positive on NRZ and collect even more dividends from NRZ so with NRZ paying me out $38 that's gonna bring my total to $74.12. That's right, guys. I am 74% of the way to my goal of $100 in dividends per month. So there we go, guys. Let me know down in the comment section which is your favorite. Do you like real estate REITs? Do you like the S&P 500 ETFs? Do you like the dividend aristocrats? Do you like the dividend kings? Have you even heard of any of those names before? Let me know down in the comment section. Of course, I love getting paid passive income whenever I can. I'm lazy, so whenever I'm getting a check by doing absolutely nothing, I love it. So I'm going to continue to dividend invest and also invest into these growth stocks that just so happen to pay dividends. So I'm not dividend chasing. Dividends come to me. You know what I mean? Go ahead and leave a thumbs up on this video. But if you made it this far in the video, go ahead and grab your two free stocks by signing up for Webull, clicking the link down in the description. Get those two free stocks, guys. It's up to $1,850. You won't regret it. It's free money. But other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show, and I'm out. Peace.